and welcome back to my channel. Singer Angie Stone is a Grammy nominated singer, songwriter, producer, actress and mother. As a member of the cast of R&B Divas, she's also topped the US Billboard R&B and dance charts. One of her hit songs was Brother, which many play on Father's Day as a salute to black men. But there's an interesting story about how it came about. I wanted to uplift brothers because the Bible teaches us that the man is head of the household, Stone began to explain. We went down the wrong road by disrespecting our men because they are them to lead our men, our boys, our sons. So we've got to start imparting some greatness in the men that we have chosen to be a part of our lives. That's why I wrote Brother. With Angie's hectic songwriting schedule, it's hard to believe she's battling diabetes as well as she is. In fact, Stone has dealt with side effects from diabetes medication, later called off the market, congestive heart failure and high blood pressure. Stone was diagnosed with type 2 diabetes in 1999. She appeared in another reality TV show, the fourth season of Celebrity Fit Club, and took up the challenge to become healthier and learn how to manage her disease. At the end of the day, I'm just real, explained Stone. I'm a real person with real problems, but I also serve a real God, so everything is going to be all right. There was a time that I did think that diets were bad. They weren't real. You know, we want next day results. Things that are time consuming like exercise and food intake over a period of time is what is necessary to actually get to your goal. When I was doing Celebrity Fit Club, I took on that show as a challenge to myself. Reality TV is not always reality TV. Once I came to understand that, hey, you really have to work hard because this is not what it's chalked up to be. I was more determined than ever at that point to lose the weight. I don't drink soda or juices. I eat candy. I've never been a junk food eater or a snacker. I have to be reminded to eat. I eat pretty healthy. I love my mom's home cooking, but even then I'll eat vegetables like collard and mustard greens or yams. I've challenged myself to be a healthier person by proportioning my food properly, exercising and just being careful, especially because I travel a lot. I make sure wherever I go, if I feel that the menu does not coincide with what I'm used to eating, that I find the healthiest way out when I'm on the road. Thanks for listening. Please like, comment and subscribe.